morning from us and the midges. They are everywhere. But we've had to come out for a little test flight because we got a new drone. Okay, maiden flight of the new, new baby. New same drone. New same drone, second hand. Ooh, we go. Obstacle avoidance is on. <laughs> Bowie barking from the van. Not a bad spot for a test flight. Oh, these friggin' midges everywhere, Rowan. Blaming you. There's a little spot from last night. We've got the heater going because it's cold. Some people have been enjoying some pistachios. Whoever was last here. I am taking shelter in the van because I'm just being bitten alive. <laughs> Poor Richards as well. Oh, they're all over his hoodie. Ooh. I think you can see them. So I think generic plan for the morning is chill out here with all the midges. Yeah, just having a bit of a chill morning in this little spot, and then we're going to head over to uh, Lock Mick um, and meet Ron and Andrew there. They are currently driving up. Um, so yeah, go and have a little explore. Well, maiden flight, apart from the midges, was a success. Nice. Ooh, someone's not impressed. <laughs> That's from bananas. So we have the perfect sheepdog moment. Yeah, Bowie likes to um, stare out the window. I thought there was humans walking by, so he's on guard. But a couple of sheepies. Was it, Bowie? You rounded them up. <laughs> oh, RMU. Oh, they heard you. <laughs> Bar you. You're a breed, you're sheep, you're clan, be true. Yep. Where are you going to take them? <laughs> you're a sheep. Where are they gone? Where are they gone? Where are they gone? Oh, I think Bowie likes sheep. <laughs> He's fine on them. Lads and lassies from Bonnie, Scotland. So, this morning, where's the set record? So, we are sort of in the countryside of Braemar. We went into Braemar yesterday, didn't we? That's the little tourist shop. Yeah, so the stop we're at, we drove through the little village, and I think we're about just five minutes through the village. Mm -hmm. And it comes to this uh, big open air countryside view. Beautiful spot. So it's nice. Awesome. It's kind of a little, it's a lay by, but with a load of trees, that side of things. Uh, so, you protected very much from loads of trees and stuff like that. So. You can hear traffic but it's not that busy and yeah. very rare cars come by so it's nice. Good little quiet spot we found. Mm -hmm. So the rest of the day is we are meeting Andrew and Rowan later on and they're currently driving from Newcastle as we speak. Mm -hmm. So they're about sort of six hours away or something like that. So the plan is we're going to go and meet them at a place called Lockmick. It's spelled M-U-I-C-K. Yeah it's spelled like sad Newick. like Spelt Muick, yeah, but it's Lock Muick. Lock Mick. Lock Mick. So we're going to go and explore a little town called Ballata, which is on the way to Lock Mick. And yeah, it's apparently, it's a very cute little town. Isn't it? Just kill a bit of time until they get there. So we're about 45 minutes from Lock Mick. Uh, Ballata's sort of on the way, so I'm guessing half an hour we're there in Ballata. Kill a few hours, have a little bit of lunch, mooch around the little shops, take both for a little walk, and meet their guys at Lock Mick later on. Mm -hmm. Dogs can have a swim in the lock. There he I think he's tired from yesterday's walk though. <laughs> Still tired, bud? Hey, easy. Hey? easy. Yeah. <laughs> right, well, we're officially invited. 
excited. It looks like there's a wedding or some kind of event on happening at Balmoral. So are we following in the army trucks or <laughs> <laughs> are we going in? No. Oh, the little dog. More, more uh, men there today. Yeah. There's def today. definitely an event of some sort. It was only two days yesterday. Yeah, we thought we'd take a detour around the Barra Barrel again because we didn't drive down here yesterday. And we can uh, we can go and see the Royal Distillery, which I think we should go and have a look at. Pop in. Yeah. I'll show you around. I can smell the malt. Yeah. So we are at the Royal Lock Nager. Rock Lock. Yeah, Nager? I, say it. I don't know. How you say it. <laughs> the Royal Distillery, anyway. Yeah. It's very expensive, but it's a lovely whiskey. You know, again, what I was saying earlier, our whiskey, us, it goes in a cask called a butt. The butt is 600, 500 liters. Okay. You know? 700, 700 liters is the maximum you can put. That's the rules and regulation. Eh? Mm. And most of the cask in Scotland, it has been seasoned with Oloroso. Sherry is a wine that Spain drinks, okay, fortified right. wine. So, this is how it goes, the normal. It goes in the Oloroso cask. What, 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 what. This one has been done a little bit special because it was for the anniversary. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we have changed a little bit of cask. It is lovely, but it is 56.3 as wow. it is limited. Oh, you've got a guest. Oh, that's fine. Ferry's <laughs> behind the bar. Yeah. He's fine. You know, you know, he's, there's some cakes in there. Yeah. Oh, no, he's nice. Come on. <laughs> Try it. This one. Taint dinner. <laughs> I don't know that. Like I said, when it's down here and you when you sift it down there and you really get like a little smell of apples. I've learned that from when we just had a little tasting. In there. Exactly. Oh, I prefer that one yeah. to the one that we had in there, yeah. Good. Oh, it's very entertaining. Enjoying it. Good host. Good host. Okay. He's French. <laughs> relax, you can relax here. I will see my. I will be famous in Manchester. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, no, yeah. because you got my picture. <laughs> oh. You will have to put button trip on my head. You know, trip on my head. You go trip on my head. Say, look at the distillery and. <laughs> so we just completed our first whiskey tour. Well, we didn't do a tour, did we? The whiskey tasting, should I say? Whiskey tasting, yeah. So they've got a little bar in there. So we ended up sitting. Well, at first we had a little sip, didn't we, in the actual shop? Yeah, just a stand-up uh, cask. They have a little tasting section. But then the guy from Mauritius that works in there was called Jerry. Eric. Eric. <laughs> <laughs> Eric was like, "No, come into the bar. Come into the bar." So yeah, we've had a little bit more. Um, very strong uh, but we have got we got one so this is for my dad happy christmas bit of a spoiler when he watches this then yeah <laughs> this way boy Maybe this way yeah, man. But yeah. yeah very very strong um i think we'd probably have a little bit more if we were staying around here yeah but we're not we've got to drive another a, half hour or so i think yeah it's a very quiet taste whiskey i've never drank it before but i think it's something that you get used to as you get older perhaps yeah maybe uh but yeah it was Good little experience, weren't it? Yeah, very informative. They were very friendly in there uh, with us and the dog and Bowie. They let him in and just took him off the lead. He just wandered around the shop, just nosing everyone for a fuss and being very friendly. Yeah. All the staff loved him. They loved it. Definitely. Yeah, a good go-to. Definitely go and have a look. And see, if you go, ask for Eric. Good yeah, host, very good host. Yeah. <laughs> they were all really nice doing yeah. that. Ha <laughs> ha
right, so we've just nearly back at the van. The guys have made it. Yay! Yay. <laughs> everybody, yeah. Can everybody remember them from Europe? <laughs> so yeah, we've just done, Hello. what's what's the track called, guys? Do you know? Lock, mate. Just the Lockmick Trail. Just the yeah. Lockmick Trail. Okay, so we've done an hour loop today and tomorrow we're gonna do a three hour loop. Which um, goes further into the mountains. And right round the lock. So yeah, the dogs have had a swim. There's well, not as many. The swim. <laughs> well, I'm more looking forward to that than the big, uh, like Glen one you guys wanted to do. <laughs> I was like, kind of feel like a flatter one. <laughs> so yeah, the dogs have had a swim, and now we're just walking back to the van. It's six o'clock, so it's dinner time. Midges are back, though, aren't they? Now. Midges are back. Getting yeah, close the, bees. the van, and midges are back. But yeah. Warm up for the bigger walk tomorrow. Get some beers. <laughs>